welcome back to Cozy Bichota. It's so nice to have you all here. Let me just adjust my little camera. Okay. Welcome back. So today, 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 we're going to do another five days. I am prepared. I am working so hard with all this stuff. But your girl, I have some pizza. I figured I had to. You, you, you can't play this game without having some. So we're going to have some pizza. You guys are going to have to deal with me eating. And we're going to do another five days. I am still trying to get the setup for all this stuff. I discovered a cinematic camera option that I could do. Um, so we're going to try that out. I feel like I'm glowing in this light right now. Anyways, let's do another five days. I have a little bit of a headache coming along. Not loving that for me. Honestly needed that. I have a little bit of a headache coming along. Which I'm worried is going to turn into a migraine since I do suffer from migraines. But we're going to play a little bit. Hopefully this gets me in the mood to digest my food. Play. And then get ready to go work out for a little bit. I feel like I need that. So let's start. And I just realized I forgot to change over to the, to the game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Love this for me. Love this for me. I don't know. We're just going to go with it. Okay. <laughs> pizza News Network. Hot topic of the week. People who don't like pizza and those who love them anyway. In other news, Chicago style or New York, tonight we let a bear decide. From our sponsor, Jeffy Speedy Ovens, now offering the Brick Blaster Mark 7. Pizza this fast used to only be fairy tales. The earlier reported pizzeria has reopened after a short snack break. Looks like we've got an enthusiastic baker on our hands. We are back with our regular scheduling, regularly scheduled DA facts. Over to you, Oliver. Hey, ZA buddies. My name is Oliver, and I've got some ZA facts just for you. Let's go. What do you think about mayo on pizza? One of Japan's most popular pizzas is the mayo jaga, topped with potato, bacon, and mayo. Sounds delicious to me. It actually sounds really good. I actually really, really, really enjoy mayo. Tune in next time for more ZA facts. Short and sweet, just like me. Until then, keep cooking. That's all for today. Good pizza, great pizza. Getting some more gems. I think I said last time what I was thinking of doing. Is it getting the faster oven? I think I extended the day so that they feel a little bit longer, but I think I also said that I wanted to get a faster oven. You are a bit better than I thought. You may not be a master ovenist like me, but you're still a pain in my oven. Get ready for next month, punk. Alicante out. I'm ready for you. Ooh, you look new. Ding dong, zero slices. Also make it dark. I'm assuming a cheese pizza. But dark is in Natalia's dark where I accidentally like burned the pizza last time or just like go in the oven twice kind of dark. Because we all know last time was, was a disaster for me with the pizzas. Oh, she said no slices. Where's the bell peppers? We want the bell pepper. You didn't say bell pepper. up already and I need to put cheese on this.
I'm supposed to do one. It's four, eight. <laughs> Natalia, how are you messing up already? I think I was just hungry because I feel like the migraine's kind of going down a little bit now. Can I get just bell peppers with no sauce? Oh, and make that well done. But like, you didn't say no cheese. Bell peppers. And what can I talk about today? I feel like I've had a pretty... I'm just starting the week because it's the beginning of the week for me. We celebrated my sister's boyfriend's birthday and went axe throwing. Your girl is not good at throwing axes, as I thought I would be. But I did my best and I did get a bullseye and I got to ring the, the little bell and celebrate that. But it's a lot harder than I thought. Like, I'd see these videos and people are, you know, thrown away and it's all good. And I'm over here struggling. It's not easy. One onion pizza, one pepper pizza, one mushroom pizza, sausage and all three. Okay, but she wants sausage. Let me just get sausage on all of them and then I'll go through the ingredients again. Two, three, one, two, two. But yeah, axe throwing. Very interesting experience for me. I've gone go karting and I actually really enjoy go karting. I did get a little queasy at first with the spinning around one pepper pizza, one mushroom. But, it wasn't so bad. But the axe throwing, I would definitely do it again. I think I just need to practice throwing, like the, what is it? <gasps> me distraje, me distraje. No, I'm gonna have to throw one out. This is so unfortunate. Y'all are getting me like, as I come, as I freaking come. It totally said one onion and one pepper. At least it takes a little bit longer now. Man, I gotta throw this pizza out. It's right there. Don't come anywhere near me. I'm mad at myself. Okay, and then it said pepper, right? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three, one, two. So upsetting. Dude. Come on. I feel like this headache might turn into a migraine. We'll see. It did extend the day. Oh, it's so good. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. I just like some bell peppers for... Also, 
I was editing the video and then I was telling my sister about it. And I was laughing hysterically because I'm trying to be better about not cursing. And she can be the She can be the witness to me kind of still not doing any better in that category, but trying. And I realized in the last video I said, thank gosh. I'm going to Cheese Town hard tonight. And I don't know why I said thank gosh. I think it's because I was really worried about saying oh my god because I'm trying to get away from that. I don't want to be saying that anymore. I'd rather be saying like oh my goodness or oh my gosh. And in the act of trying to be more cognizant of not saying oh my god, I accidentally said oh my thank gosh. I don't know who gosh is. <laughs> I, I meant to say thank God. Or thank goodness. Either one is fine. But I genuinely meant to say thank God. And I was re-watching it and laughing at myself. Oh, Natalia. Okay. I still think that's ridiculous that... I, didn't, I don't remember reading that she said bell pepper. Oh my gosh. Okay, you guys, story time. I don't I don't do cockroaches. They like legitimately terrify me. And the fact that we need to do a bug spray because there could be cockroaches in this place. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I mean I'm paying for that right away. I don't care. I don't I like they are like just even I need to get this off the screen. I absolutely hate cockroaches. They're disgusting. They're one of my phobias. If I ever see them in the apartment, I freak out. I freak out. I cannot do cockroaches. Disgusting. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, what do we have for decorations? The antique registered. Not really my thing. The Grecian clay pot is kind of cute, but. The pizza. Trireme? Trireme? I don't even know how to pronounce that, but... Oh, I can make a gold leaf tip jar. We're getting all Greek themed here. What was the thing that I wanted to do? Oh, oh my gosh, stop. There was something that I wanted to get, though. Why am I, why am I confused? Back? Oh, it's doing the double... The double mouse thing again. Oh, upgrades, upgrades. Didn't I, oh, I did daylight saving. I want a slower happy meter. That would be kind of good. In the oven. Oh no, I'm good. I'm good, honey. Oh my gosh! See? Good day to be eating pizza. Chapter 2 unlocked! Pizza News Network. Alicante's yard sale. Bargain prices on used ingredients, barely washed utensils, and as is pies. Everything must go so I can mow my lawn. In other news, Massachusetts Institute of Tastology <laughs> is rated the most delicious university in the nation. Finally, shadow societies are shaping the face of your pizza. Who are they and what are their orders? That's all for today. Good pizza, great pizza. No, I don't remember you. No. Oh, oh I'm your landlord. So I just leased your lease to the fine people at Pie Chart. They will help out with your rent. The better your rating, the lower the rent. The worse your rating, the higher the rent. Get it? Good. I'll check in before the end of the month. That's nice. Used oven booster two times. What is that? Oh, this double mouse thingy is gonna drive me nuts. 80 fruit toppings. Still. 
Then my friend told me, well, I plan to have seeds. So, fruit. And I told her no. No. I refuse to agree with that. One cheese pizza, don't forget the sauce. I've had people forget the sauce. How do you forget the sauce? I'm having a cheese pizza right now. Double mouse thingy. Come on now, I don't know if that's a me issue or a game issue. Thank y'all for enduring me eating my pizza. I'm just hungry. Great, exactly what I asked for. Oh my gosh! The little baby in the back! What a freaking cutie! One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two. Such a cutie. Also kind of creepy though, I will say. I'm like, have Z's on that one. Square root of pi, carry the one. Too much. One onion pizza, one pepper pizza, one mushroom pizza, sausage and all three. Okay. Let's get the sausage on all of them, not these. And then, remember the rest. <clears throat> Two, three, one, two, one, two, three, four. Also, I just got, I think it's called Chilquarium. And, okay, wait, onion, pepper. I want to maybe start stream, uh, not stream. I'm not ready to stream yet. Nowhere near there. I want to do some playthroughs of it because it seems like such a cute game. So that might come soon. Maybe I'll start a series on that one as well. Because you just like build up your aquarium with fishies. And that doesn't sound bad at all. And it was only I think $5.99. Which I thought was a pretty pretty good price. And like I said, I'm trying to get a little bit more into PC gaming. I'm in front of a computer all day as it is for work. So, you know, you expect to be tired of it by the end of the day, which I am. But I do get up and walk around. And I do like just having like different platforms to play. Instead of just my Switch and my Steam Deck. I'm in love with my Steam Deck. I have been hooked on Bay Farm. I have been hooked. So, my goodness. Onion pizza, please. I'm going on a date. Also, make it dark. Why would you have onion pizza if you're going on a date? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. If anyone wants to comment what their favorite games are at the moment right now, what they can't live without, the game that's got them hooked, please let me know. I do take recommendations because I'd like to try some new games out. I would label myself more of a cozy gamer. And I told him not to give me a call right now. Did I make it dark? Okay. I feel like I didn't. 
two olive pizzas. Oh, and cut those in half. But yeah, I will take recommendations. I don't do battles. I don't really like fighting. I do have Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. I want to finish it. But I'm like lost or confused on how to play, I guess, because it's been a while since I played a, 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 excuse me, a Zelda game. So I'm just a little confused. So I might get the... But I get the piece of the new but yeah. Um, I might get a guide. I'm a very big guide person. I also just like collecting the books themselves. I think they're beautiful. People take the time to do the art and put it all together. Pretty nice. Alright, you're bumping over here. I want a pizza with pepper, onion, pepperoni, and olive with pepperoni and onion. Huh? I want a pizza with pepper, onion, pepperoni. And olive with pepperoni and onion. Each only on half. I'm so confused. I want a pizza with pepper, onion, and pepperoni. Okay, let's start small. It says pizza with pepper, onion, and pepperoni. Is it pepper? Pepper? Pepper, onion, and pepperoni. Onion. Pepperoni. Start it. And the other one is olive and olive with pepperoni and onion. Olive. Pepperoni. Each only on half. Oh, oh no, 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 it's going past the 50. Ugh, whatever. Over it. I probably messed this up too. Next time, try putting on more bell pepper on this half. I was so confused with that order. Edith, Edith. <clears throat> Girl, I am shouting you out. I have to pay 15 bucks in rent, plus the refund. I made no money because of... <sighs> the tips I got basically canceled out with that refund. Okay. That was so upsetting. I'm making no money. Oh, Taste of Rome set. That's why that's coming in. Well then. Tonight on Brickfire, the stewards of sacred ingredients, eccentric cults are savvy, savvy supply consortium cornering the market. In other news, Deep Dish Ga Gang has been threatening suppliers, but the stewards of sacred ingredients will not be intimidated. The sauce must flow. Finally, archaeology students from Notre Dame <laughs> unearthed the tomb of Pizzian Pharaoh Pepertiti. That's all for today. Good pizza. Great pizza. Greetings to you, popular pizza parlor proprietor. Your prowess has piqued the palates of our organization, the stewards of the sacred ingredients. You might have noticed our lodge across the street. 
Yes. Is that the chains across the street? The saw sayers have foreseen a transcendent za, so we intend to test you with trials of talent and taste. But for now, we want three pies, one plain, one vegetarian, one with meat. Okay, one plain. <clears throat> One vegetarian. One with meat. Can't I? Oh, I've got three stars. I don't, why am I looking at that? Where's the book? Cause I'm not losing time. I just want to double check what their definition of vegetarian is. Mushrooms, so everything. But I could do a classic meat of just pepperoni and sausage. Okay. And our delicious eggplant, which I also learned that, and I, I'm literally calling you out on this, my sister's boyfriend doesn't like eggplant. Like we went out to dinner and he got chicken parm, fine, I'm not gonna come at you for the chicken parm, but does not like eggplant parm. How do you not like eggplant parm? Come on, dude. Eggplant farm is where it's at. That's all I gotta say about that. Also, y'all are getting all natural to tell you right now because I am already in my PJs. So it was one of those days. Just working my PJs today. And because I've got a bit of a headache, I didn't really feel like dressing up today. Last one. So you're getting nice raw content. Raw. Ooh, I am kind of liking this camera stuff. I need to figure out lighting. Okay, I think I did it. Excellent. Your first trial starts on the dawn of the next pizza festival. Before then, we will send something to expand your topping spectrum. Is it like anchovies or something? Hey, cheese. Half pep. Oh, and I got more books on my Nook. And a lot of them, like, on sale. I'm always checking daily. Sometimes they have, like, daily Nook finds. And they'll have books for, like, two bucks. So I read just a little bit of the story about it because I don't also want to just spend two bucks on Even though it's only two. On a book, if I'm not actually going to enjoy it in the end. Plus, it's just going to take up space on my Nook. So I've been getting some pretty good deals, too. And sometimes they have free ones. Everything here looks so delicious, but my stomach is weak to any meat or cheese. So let's give you a sauce. Is this, you want a vegan pizza? But yeah. I've been getting some pretty good books, which I'm excited to read. I have to finish the one that I'm reading right now. But I got this one called Pumpkin Cafe, Spice Cafe. I mm. <laughs> I can't remember the name. And then I got a few more books that are a little bit more in like the magical 
wizardy realm. I've been really getting into those lately. And then I've got my classic thrillers on there that I need to, to get into as well. I just finish them up. But it's so nice. I've been having issues like falling asleep. So sometimes I'll just grab my nook and read a bit until it makes me tired. And that's been working. Dang pizza, you're looking good. Okay, I did it right. She wanted a vegan pizza. Can I get one with onion and one with pepperoni and sausage? Don't cut any of them. Don't cut. One. I don't even remember what you said, but I'm just going to do the basics of the sauce and the cheese. But yeah, reading before bed. I've been helping a bit with the insomnia. One with onion and one with pep and sausage. One with onion. So... Pep and sausage. I just highly recommend reading. It's so nice. So nice. You just get lost in a different world that isn't yours. And who was I talking to? Was it my sister? It was somebody I was talking to. I can't remember right now. The nice thing about reading is that you you imagine the characters the way that you imagine them. Right? So the, I was, I think it was with my therapist. You imagine the characters the way you think that you'll imagine them. So they'll give you a description, obviously. Say like some, maybe the character is a blonde hair, blue eyed girl enjoying the summers in like Kentucky or something like, ah, oh, don't cut them. Pizza is pizza. Fudge. One flatbread pizza, please. Nothing on it. Oh. Is it just bread? Or is it like sauce and cheese? You know what, girl? You got a piece of bread. But anyway, so you kind of like imagine the character yourself. So I just imagine what I would imagine a blonde hair would be like. Eh, almost. Maybe. Could I get just bell peppers with no sauce? So it's nice. It's nice because I imagine them the way that I do. And it's nice when a book doesn't have a movie, because then the movie kind of destroys the way that I would have imagined the character. Not that I'm saying that books that have movies are bad. Just that I do like having my own interpretation of what I think the character is. Oh, the mice, the mouse is back to normal. So yeah. You made my stomach dance. Oh, she's cute. Half pepperoni and bell, half mushrooms that smell. Put that in the oven twice. Half pepperoni and bell. Half pepperoni, two, three, four. Half pepperoni and bell. Half mushrooms that smell. I don't know if that means that you want onions too, but you didn't specify onions. Oh, I feel like this headache is starting to take over a bit. Let's see if I can make it through to five days. Not might have to make this just a little bit shorter. Maybe take something. Because I do need to work out. I'd recommend this pizza to a friend. That tip jar though. Mama likes. There once was a human who ordered a pepperoni and sausage. That human is me. And it's starting to get really nice out. Like the weather that I really enjoy, which is cool. <laughs> That's why I really like the fall. I put a oh no. Or just once, okay. But it's starting to get really nice out. 
like walk outside with my t-shirt and I'm not sweating. I'm always sweating though. That's just a thing for me. But at night, those nights are nice. Oh, I've served a bunch. I'm here for an onion- oops, I read that too fast- for an onion and mushroom pizza. So yeah. This weather- I might start running again actually because the weather is nice. Oh my gosh, did you see mushroom? Yeah. I don't like when it's too hot. I feel like really, really exhausted afterwards. It actually triggers headaches for me. Even though I hydrate, like I do hydrate. I love water, I'm constantly drinking water. But honestly, running when it's that hot, not fun. So I might start picking up running again to do that as my cardio. Ah, fudge, she said twice now. Keep trying, you'll get it. Oops. No refunds. Thank goodness. Ooh, I made a decent profit. Why am I getting charged $10 in rent? Why am I getting charged rent every day? Rent isn't charged every day. Oh, we can get pesto sauce. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see. You did day 21, day 22, and day 23. I have to do two more days. Can I push through? This is part of the story. Oh my gosh, why is it? Oh, I'm still on the trial. Why does that look like... Is that pineapple? Stop. Am I going to be able to make Hawaii pizza? This looks like it could maybe be whole wheat. This looks like ham. Got some bacon. That looks like some spinach. I also actually really like spinach on pizza. This looks like anchovies. Right? You put anchovies on pizza and pesto sauce. That's a hundred. Okay. How do I... I might have to cut it short because... My head. It's my head. So we have to do day 24 still. So day 21, day 22, day 23, day 24, day 25. And then we have to start on day 26. So I'm going to have to make it up. I might just do an extra day the next two episodes. We'll see. We'll see. Or, yeah, because do a 7 and 1, I'd have to talk less. Switch that over to just talking. I am... See, if I put my hand up here, I look the way that I want to look, right? <laughs> I'm looking the way that I want to look, but I put it down here and it's just getting too much of the light up there. We'll figure it out at some point. I'll figure out the whole the whole thing. Man, that's the perfect lighting right there for me. I mean, that's the, the lighting I'm envisioning. We'll get there. We'll get there. Thank you for bearing with me with the migraine that is starting to brew up. Um... I think I'm gonna go look at my little my little Batman plushy thingy. The ones that you like do them inside out. No, he's mad. Isn't he so cute? Oh, can you see my nails better in this lighting now? Kind of ish. You definitely see the blue better. Which I think this might be the color it's supposed to be. Can we focus on the nails? Yeah, it's basically like the color that it's supposed to be. My head looks, uh, my hair looks a lot red. A lot more red than it actually is. Um, and... My little workouts! They're called Bichota workouts! So that's the workouts that my sister's boyfriend told me. So I have them written out. This like motivates me a lot more. And I switch it up. So I'm not constantly doing this whole thing every single time I do legs and arms, but I switch it up. These are just some examples of things that I can do. So these are like, I would consider them my starter workouts until I get a little bit better and more confident and build up a little bit more strength. And then I'll probably ask him for 
some other variations of workouts that I could do. So I'm gonna probably go take something. See if it helps with the head. We relax a little bit. I'll probably do like a an evening workout. Work out for a bit. And then probably just game for a while. My issue is with the migraines, it like throws me off from working out, and I really do want to because I want to do it five days a week. So but yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for everyone that keeps coming back. Share with your friends, family, anybody that you think that would like really enjoy watching these videos. I do appreciate it. I'm super new. I'm still learning. I'm really enjoying this though. Like this is probably one of my highlights of the week is sitting down and getting to game for a bit and have some fun and getting to share it with everyone else. Like this is super fun. I can, I, I see why people really like doing this. So thank you so much. So from one beach at the to another, stay cozy and see you next time. Adios.